Right now, it's little more than an empty lot. But the future site of the Remy Art Gallery of Saskatchewan recently became much more beautiful. And now to bring this exceptional Picasso collection to Saskatchewan is the most exhilarating and rewarding experience of my life. Ellen Remy purchased 405 prints by Pablo Picasso valued at $20 million and has donated them to the new gallery effectively doubling the value of its permanent collection. In many ways, I think it's going to put us on the map. I, I think, I think we, have, we have a game changer. We, we have an asset here now that I think the city can leverage to, to brand, market and promote this place and what it offers to people and, and new employees and workers and visitors from around the world. The collection includes 193 of the 197 lino cuts Picasso made between 1951 and 1966 as well as 212 working proofs. They were purchased from the collection of Picasso's printer and are in excellent condition. So we will be paying very close attention to our lighting and our humidity controls. It's unfortunate they couldn't be here with us today, but that's one of the reasons is that we want to make sure that they remain in that kind of pristine uh, condition as they did in the, in the printer's own uh, workshop. The donation is especially exciting for the gallery's chief curator, Lisa Baldessera who has been on the job for a little more than a month. The former U of S art student who has worked internationally beat out 22 other applicants for the job. We wanted to find somebody who brought a good understanding of the Canadian te uh, contemporary scene. Uh, we also wanted somebody who um, understood um, the context of our gallery, uh, a gallery on the prairies, which is different than a gallery in southern Ontario or the west coast. So I spent three years here in the mid-90s and I was uh, incredibly moved by the kind of community spirit and work ethic and uh, just that kind of commitment to a broader picture that comes out of Saskatchewan. These are replicas of two of the more famous prints in the collection. Eventually, the genuine articles will be placed on the third floor of the gallery in a dedicated Picasso salon. While the building won't open for at least two years, Baldessera believes this collection is just a hint of things to come. An international gallery in Saskatoon is our vision and it is absolutely where we're headed. So this is, um, this is extraordinary and the programming that we are building and that we're going to do on every level from contemporary art to modern art and to more historical work is our vision for this place. From River Landing in Saskatoon, I'm Simon Hyatt reporting.